Who prepares a contract of sale in a real estate transaction? The seller prepares a contract of sale. That's the standard practice. The person that is selling a piece of property engages the services of an attorney in New York. Other states may do it differently. In New York, you need an attorney and the attorney prepares a contract of sale with the information that's pertinent to the deal. The property address, the name of the seller, the name of the buyer, uh, the down payment, the mortgage contingency clause, and then sends the contract typically with a writer to the attorney for the buyer. And then the buyer and the buyer's attorney will review, uh, request changes, make changes, um, amend the contract in some way, perhaps. Usually there is discussion about it. There's conversation. I could go over at some point what possible changes a buyer might want. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. And the buyer will sign, ultimately, a few copies of the contract with a down payment and send that back to the attorney for the seller. And the seller and the attorney and their attorney will review if there are any changes or review terms and conditions of the contract and then affix their signature. The deposit will be placed into the attorney's escrow account. It can't be used, pledged, given away. Nothing can be done with it. It's uh, in a sacred account until the date of closing. And um, that's a little bit of a snapshot of who prepares a contract of sale. And I'll explain a little bit more in uh, future episodes. <laughs> FrankBrunoLaw.com. Woohoo!